Sometimes a pediatrician gets a call and the mother gives a baby a bath, maybe about 18 months, two years old, and they feel a mass in the belly. And everybody's upset. They know where they feel, they, they feel a mess. And the Pete feels, and he feels the mess. He says, you've got to see a surgeon right away. In your head, if you were told you're going to see a kid in the office that has a mass in the belly, what would go through your head? Uh, two, three-year-old, year-and-a-half-old, taking a bath, a routine exam, and the pediatrician is a mass in the belly on the side. The pediatric surgeon thinks of a cancer of the kidney. The cancer of the kidney that we see in children is called a Wilms tumor, named after a 19th century. That's uh, pretty rare. Like, that are very rare. There's only about 500 in the United States per year. Uh, when it is a mass in the belly, it's uh, most often kidney, but it could be a, a benign disease. It's not necessarily cancer. It could be an obstruction with a uh, swollen kidney. And a girl, a uter an ovary can make a giant mass, and that's often, that's rarely going to be cancer in a little baby. That'll be a big cyst full of fluid. But getting back to Wilms tumor, if you saw it, you got rid of it, is the prognosis good or bad with this? The prognosis is very good, but this one you need the pediatric oncologist. They're the real uh, orchestra leaders here. The pediatrician gets your... Uh, baby in touch with a pediatric cancer expert. They need the right imaging before any surgeon operates and they need the right uh, staging and then the surgeon operates and removes that kidney completely through an abdominal operation and then um, they often need a little chemotherapy, occasionally a little radiation across the board survival 90 plus percent one of the greatest success stories of modern cancer treatment. You hear about all the misery and the lack of success, but in pediatrics, this uh, kidney cancer called Wilms, it was about a 15% survival early in uh, the 20th century. It's now a 90 plus percent survival between the chemotherapy, the radiation, the surgery, the safe anesthesia, all these sorts of things combined team effort, a uh, really good outcome in most cases. What about, it? could it be ever, ever have a, something coming off the liver or something like that too? Well, yeah, it could, there are uh, less common even than that, a uh, couple of cancers of the liver that can affect uh, children and uh, when they're very, very young, interestingly, the outcome can be good. That's also a combination often of uh, chemotherapy and uh, surgery and there you absolutely have to be in the hands of a, of a children's center that has um, so it's a team approach. Oncology. The team approach. No question. You need the nurse specialists. You need the child life team, the social workers, and a lot of different uh, medical specialists.